morning welcome to another vlog i am going shopping today <laughs> so i thought i would take you along for the ride um i have to return something to nordstrom so i don't know if you guys remember during my anniversary sale haul i ordered not ordered i was in store and i purchased those frame jeans they're really comfortable but the the fit's just not right they're very big in the waist and they're tight in the thigh. So it's this really weird, like the whole jean looks like it fits up my leg, but then it's like kind of saggy at the top. It's very strange. So I'm gonna return those. Um, I think the cut just isn't for me. I don't think it's a matter of size. Um, so anyway, I'm gonna return those. And then I was gonna head over to the Wynn um, and just take a look at some of the boutiques there because I usually end up going to Bellagio, Crystals, even Caesars. I don't know if I've taken you guys along to Caesars with me, but um, I never ever go to the Wynn and they have incredible, incredible boutiques. And I just thought, why not? And I want to get an early start. Um, I'm going to get there when they open at like 10 a.m. That's really when the strip is the most calm, <laughs> the most calm and the quietest. So I am just uh, just about done like with all my skincare. I just pulled my hair back and I wanted to share with you an incredible deal that is going on. I am working with Grown Alchemist in today's video and they are 40% off at Ulta right now. 40% off. And so I've been using their products for like two to three weeks now and there are definitely some standout products that I wanna share with you. The first one is their Hydro Restore Cream Cleanser and it has olive leaf and plantango, plantago extract. Maybe that's how you pronounce it. In any case, this has been an incredible day or night cleanser. If I do have makeup on at night, I will use a makeup remover just to get off like that, you know, initial layer of foundation, eye makeup, that sort of thing. Their cream cleanser is incredible. I love the texture. I'm just gonna squeeze some out here. So the texture is rich but not too thick and it's not greasy at all. And it just, yeah, it just does an incredible job removing makeup, uh, removing like just dirt, grime, oil, all of that. But it leaves my skin feeling really, really just like well-nourished, but not, oh, it's like not oily or anything. Despite me having dry skin, I really don't like cleansers that leave my skin feeling like to moisturize, I think you guys know what I mean because then I just don't feel like it's clean. But anyway, this, because it has that cream texture, it just, yeah, it just does an incredible job like leaving my skin feeling moisturized, but it rinses away really, really cleanly. So been loving that cream cleanser. Um, and the other thing that I'm really loving is their day cream. So this is, what's the proper title? The Hydro Repair Day Cream. And it has camellia and geranium blossom in here. And I actually have, that's like the last step that I put on today that you see on my skin. So it's a really like, really comfortable like day cream. And, but what I really love about it is it almost has like a skin like finish. So I don't feel like I have like all this like cream and product on my face. And that has been like the absolute best, especially in the summertime because I just get so hot here in Vegas. And I just feel like I'm like sweating all of my skincare off sometimes. And I don't have that sensation with this day cream. So I really wanted to recommend that. And then I've been using their um, body cleanser in the uh, shower. You can see I'm almost done with this one. But this is another uh, great body cleanser because it's almost like their cream cleanser. Like I feel very, very clean. I feel very fresh. I don't necessarily feel like there's like an oil left behind or whatever, but my skin doesn't feel dry. It's just a really great kind of straightforward body cleanser and it yeah it's just been great so um those are some of the highlights but 40 percent off at ulta definitely definitely take advantage of that um if you don't know much about grown alchemist they are an australian skincare brand uh started by two brothers it's just a really like unique and natural and holistic beauty brand and i'm just really enjoying using the product so again 40 percent off at ulta i will leave a link down below my description box to uh, their products, their page on Ulta, and a big thank you to them for working with me on today's video. So I am going to finish getting ready and then we will head out to the strip. I've got to check on the weather because we have to do that now in Vegas. It has been super duper rainy, uh, muggy, uh, the winds have been picking up in the afternoon. Like it's just been really, really erratic. Um, and I never ever feel like I have to check the weather in Vegas before I get dressed or like figure out what I'm gonna wear, but, but lately I do. 
lately I do. So I'm gonna do that, get dressed, and then we'll head off to the strip. Okay, before I head out, I just wanted to show you what I have on my lips, because I think uh, some of you may ask, but I've got the Sisley Fito Twist, no, Fito Lip Twist, uh, in number seven, the Coral shade and I actually just put a little bit on my cheeks too. That's it, that's all I'm doing. And my outfit is nothing special. I just have a black shirt dress on, but I put on my Loewe Flow Runners because there's a Loewe at uh, the Wynn and I definitely want to check out the boutique. I am thinking about getting a flamenco clutch. I have been eyeing that clutch for a very long time now. <laughs> and they've come out with so many more colors, even like, different sizes where they, I think they've gone down to like a nano size. Anyway, I just wanted to go in store and just uh, check out all the colors or whatever and, and check out all the sizes. Um, so anyway, and then I've got my Chanel 22 bag. Uh, and that's it, that's it. I am ready, I am ready to go. We are on our way to the strip. I know you guys are dying to know about the weather. <laughs> Um, so the weather here in Vegas is a little bit cooler than usual. We are talking like high 80s, low 90s. However, it's because it's super cloudy out. I don't even need my sunglasses. And um, the humidity, the last I checked, was 59%. Now, coming from New York, that's not a high humidity level. But for Vegas, where it's usually like around 10%, <laughs> It feels like pea soup out here. So anyway, that's why I chose to wear this um, black shirt dress because it's just, it's like gauzy and it's giant and I just feel like I'm practically wearing nothing. Um, and it's great. It's great for this kind of weather. So that's what we're doing. All right. I'm going to sign off until we get there because I'm about to get on to the freeway.
I'm already back from the win and I'm gonna do a little haul for you guys and talk about my shopping trip but right now I'm actually rushing off to a place called Stride which is uh, I, I, I guess it's like a gym and it's over in Henderson and they're having an open house um, they actually have like these treadmills that I've been really really interested in trying not for the first time I actually used to use these treadmills a long long time ago um, anyway, long story short, they have, it's basically a gym, kind of like a soul cycle, but with treadmills instead of bikes. And I am definitely much more of a treadmill person versus a bike person. So yeah, I was really happy to find this place and also see that they're having this open house. So that's where we're headed to now. out stride in Henderson and it's um, it's basically like a treadmill class and they have three different kinds of classes uh, where you know basically it's like a variety of like uh, how much time you're on the tread and whether or not you're doing weights or whatever and uh, the reason why I came across this place is because they have these woodway treadmills which I love I used woodway treadmills like in the late 90s and haven't used them since and I've been like pining over them <laughs> ever since and so yeah we kind of came across this uh, place they're brand new they opened like a month ago and the entire gym is full of or they're you know all of their treadmills are these woodway treadmills they're super cushiony but also at the same time it really feels like you're outside running as well like there's almost enough give back because if you run on a regular treadmill it's easier than when you're running like on the road or whatever outside and these treadmills are just a really nice combination of having more cushion but also feeling like you're running outside I just love them so I'm just trying to figure out like do I cancel Arch Theory or whatever I'm I just signed up for a free class here so I guess um, I shouldn't decide anything until then but um, yeah I'm really excited so I'm gonna come back Wednesday morning and I'm gonna do a combo class which is um, half of the time on the treadmill and half of the time doing weights um, and then they have a stride class which is the whole class is um, on the treadmill and I haven't really like spent that much time on the treadmill in a long time I used to spend you know hours <laughs> on the treadmill at a time um, and so yeah I want to kind of build up to that and it, it's really exciting the guy was really really nice who was uh, talking us through but I'm just excited to get back on one of those woodway treadmills so anyway that was a really nice um, experience just getting like the the talk from them and, and hearing about like their class and their philosophy and all that stuff um, so if you're in the Vegas area definitely check one out I don't know uh, you know this one is brand new I don't know if there are others in the Vegas area but um, they are a big chain so maybe not necessarily if you're in Vegas if you are um, anywhere check out your city, your closest city, and see if they have stride. So we're heading back home, and oh, I have to show you what I got at the Wynn this morning. Hey guys, so I just wanted to show you what I uh, purchased yesterday at Wynn. It is the next day. I completely lost steam <laughs> yesterday after we uh, checked out stride, and you know, we had to take care of the dog, and then we had to figure out dinner, blah, blah, blah. So anyway, um, it is the next day. Let me show you what I purchased at the Win. I did get something at Loewe, and I did actually do a little bit of damage at Diptyque. So Diptyque at the Win is the only Diptyque boutique we have here in Las Vegas, and it is relatively new. Uh, they've been open for, I don't know, not, not too long. I think actually they opened during the pandemic, which is why I have not gotten a chance to visit them. So here is my bag of goodies. And the first thing, or the main reason why I went there was because I wanted to get this uh, refill. I wanted to get a refill for my exfoliating hand wash. Um, I'm pretty much done with it. And it comes in this beautiful like glass jar uh, with a pump. Um, and this refill basically you know, fills up the whole bottle. Um, and of course, obviously I didn't wanna get a whole bottle. So I just got the refill, which is really, really great. I love the, um, exfoliating bits that this um, hand wash has and it has a really nice kind of like light 
a very light floral, light citrus. It's like a very fresh, uh, very lightly sweet kind of scent. So it's just, it's very nice, it's very pleasant. You guys know how much I love uh, like a really beautiful fragranced hand soap. Um, so that was my purpose for stopping into the Diptyque um, boutique. And uh, I actually walked away with two candle holders. So I had seen these candle holders on their website and I just always, you know, would like flip through their website and just sort of admire these. So it was really nice to be able to see them in person. Um, so I got one, is this a larger medium? I got one that fits like their standard kind of candle. Can't remember the size of it, but the, the regular, the regular size I'll say. And here, let me take it out. It comes in this box, which is really beautiful, a lot of fun. And it is packaged very nicely, but the gentleman that helped me at the store said just be very careful when taking this out because they are two pieces. Um, so here is the top piece. And then at the bottom is the base, essentially. So you put the candle in there and then you put the glass piece on top. Isn't that pretty? I'll have to show you um, in another vlog when I actually put a candle in here and light it up. Sorry, I'm like so sweaty because it is thunderstorming yet again here in Vegas and it's so humid here, which is so unusual, but here we are. I'm just like sweating like a dog. My AC is like blowing directly on me. It's not, it's not helping. I'm really excited to get a candle in here and see uh, what that looks like. So that's one candle holder I got. And then I got one for a smaller size. I mean, a votive would fit in here, but not the votive. It's like the size between the regular size and the votive, uh, because I do have a couple of candles that size. And this had a different design. So same idea, packaged in the same way, different box. And this has a slightly different design. Let me take everything out. And I actually wanna get a big one in this design as well. This one is swirled and it's got that one black swirl running up there. And it looks like it's crisscross, but it's, what you're actually seeing is a swirl on the other side. So it's only, actually, let me stick my hand in here. I don't know if that helps. Yeah, then you can see like the swirl that goes on just on one side of the glass. And same idea, it has the base here. And let me hold up these two as a comparison. So again, this is for the regular candle and this is for the slightly smaller one. So they had all of these like really lovely objects for the home and yeah, they had this, um, vase there that's like made out of wax that was like really super cool looking so i have a feeling i'll be going back there um, and getting more stuff oh there's actually one more thing that i got so diptyque is getting into wallpaper and most of their wallpaper looks very kind of like mid-century modern it looks very mod like um, but very beautiful colors not too uh, crazy, very, very true to that kind of mid-century modern aesthetic. Um, but there was one pattern in there that stood out to me, and it's a little bit more um, Art Nouveau than I think, than mid-century modern, but I'm not that well versed in, in any of that. Um, but isn't this such a cool pattern? Isn't that neat? And I don't know if you can see, but there's like strawberries in there and um, berries, like raspberries, blackberries, and it's just black and white, and I really, really love it. I'm thinking about putting this in my dining room. I'm not sure how it would look with, like I think the furniture I got is plain enough that you, it'll kind of go with whatever, but I just wanna make sure this isn't too far off of the style, so I need to kind of like look into this, put this up on the wall or whatever, but I just really, really love this pattern. If it doesn't uh, suit the dining room, then I'll probably end up putting it someplace else. I feel like I need to have this someplace in my home. I just think it's so fun. It's so fun, it's so uh, beautiful, and yeah, I love it. So, Diptyque wallpapers, get into it. Um, all right, so that's what I got at Diptyque. Let's move on to Lueve. So here is, <laughs> here's the shopping bag. 
from Ueve. Isn't it pretty? It's actually, let me show you the back. It's different cactus. Isn't that, <laughs> isn't that cool? And so like Las Vegas appropriate, even though this is, uh, it's not about Las Vegas, it's about something else. Anyway, uh, let me go ahead and just um, open everything. Oh, she put a lot of stuff in here. Let's see. We have, I guess a Loewe, oh yeah, like a Loewe catalog <gasps> with Loewe stickers, no way. Oh, this is so cool. So I did end up getting um, a flamenco clutch, which I, I think was telling you guys yesterday before heading over to win that that was uh, sort of my goal for the day. There was one color in particular that I had seen online and I, I just wanted to make sure that I would like it and so I wanted to see it in person. And I did, I really, really liked it. Okay, there's two um, boxes in my bag, but I essentially just got one thing. So I'm just gonna go ahead and unbox it. And then, sorry, this is really awkward. <laughs> I may just uh, put this down and show you the final result. Okay, let, let's just do that. Let's just get to the good stuff, Michelle. Okay, here is the bag in the dust bag, and they did give me some like fragrance samples, which is really nice. I think this is just either an authentic authenticity card. Yeah, I think this is it, because I think I, I have the receipt elsewhere. Um, but here it is in the dust bag, and here is the clutch that I got. So this color, I believe, is um, ochre, and I just really love this like kind of like mildly acid wash uh, like greenish yellow. In some lights, it looks uh, almost like a caramel brown. It's just such an interesting color, and I love it. I especially love it with black. It looks really acidic next to black. Um, so I got the medium size, which is like the original size. And what I love about this bag is how uh, versatile it is in terms of carrying it. So let me take out all the stuffing here. So it's this floppy clutch. It has a magnetic closure. And uh, if you are familiar with Loewe, um, they are first and foremost like a leather goods brand. And so their leather is absolutely impeccable. It is so soft and buttery, but it doesn't feel like too precious. Like you can't, like you don't wanna use it. You're just like afraid that you're gonna ruin it just with your hands. It, it's not like that. It definitely has a strength to it, but it's so, so soft, so incredibly soft. So the flamenco clutch has like a drawstring here, uh, which, which closes, has like knots down here with these like leather strings. So cool, look how thick these leather strings are. Uh, what you can also do is pull the other side of the drawstrings. Hold on. So the other side of the drawstrings, you can pull those tight and carry it this way, like a little short handle, a little wristlet, if you will. Really, really cool. And then you have the knots just sort of hanging off the edge. Or it comes with, let me just open this back up. It comes with... Um, a shoulder strap so you can actually wear it cross body, which is so, so great. So let me attach this. So it basically has this little knot here. So you just pull that off. And then there are these kind of gold, let me see if I can show you, these gold D-rings here that you can attach the strap to. Sorry, so I'm filming on a different camera now because my other one just <laughs> ran out of space on the card. Anyway. Here is the flamenco clutch with the leather strap handle. I don't remember where I left off, but I just attached um, this leather strap to the D-rings on the inside. And if you feel like holding it as a clutch, you can just tuck the strap inside, which is really nice that they make it just this like very like fine leather. It's not like too bulky or whatever because it just tucks away really, really easily. Um, so that is the medium sized flamenco clutch. And then I purchased a little add-on, if you will. That's what's in this uh, smaller box. Let me go ahead and open that up. This is much easier to hold up than that other box. Little dust bag here. So what I ended up purchasing is a little additional handle. I just couldn't resist because of this braiding detail and it, it just makes the bag, which is already very versatile, even more versatile. So 
Let me show you how this goes on. So it's the same idea. It has those um, like buttons as a fastener. And so then you attach it to the end over here, the like drawstring end, and then just fasten it back up, much like the leather strap. And then the same thing with the other side. Same deal, so you just stick the, the gold knob through. And then you can always pull on the knots to close it. Then you have this really cool way to hold it in your hand, which I just adore. Like I liked when she showed me like pulling the drawstring, like the other ends, and then being able to carry it as a wristlet. I thought that was really cool. But I just, I fell in love with like these colors. This is like an olive green, and then this is like a neon yellow. And the braiding, it just, it just added such a special touch to an already very special bag. So anyway, this is like an add-on that you can purchase. They also have like a, like a gold chain. They call it, I think, a donut chain because it has like these puffy round uh, gold links. Um, you can purchase that and put it where you put the leather strap and so that makes the bag like a little fancier. I was looking at um, the same style but in a small size black with that gold chain and I thought, oh, that would make such a nice like kind of understated but slightly glam kind of like evening bag because of that gold chain it would make a little glam um, but I went with this one because I was like this is a little bit more um, every day and not quite as fancy schmancy as that one so this is the bag that I ended up getting and I've been dying dying for a flamenco clutch for a really really long time I don't know I just kept getting like sidetracked, sidetracked by like Chanel bags or Fendi bags, but finally I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna bite the bullet because I know I'm gonna use this so much, so, so much. They even came out with um, a gold version of this, and when it comes to leathers and treating leathers, I don't think anyone beats Loewe. They're just the absolute best. Um, and so if you're looking for like a metallic bag, uh, but that isn't gonna like, crack or do anything weird, I would definitely check out the Loewe Flamenco in gold if you're looking for something like this or if this appeals to you at all. So I am going to go because the weather has really turned quite crazy outside <laughs> and I need to, uh, anyway, I need to take care of some stuff in the backyard. I'm like sitting here staring at the weather, just it getting worse and worse. Um, but thank you guys so, so much for tuning into this vlog. I will have more on this bag, more on those diptyque candle holders. I'll like set them up and everything and show them to you in the next vlog. Um, and a big, big thank you to Grow and Alchemist for working with me on this video. Definitely, definitely do not forget to check out um, the Ulta site. Grow and Alchemist is 40% off today and I believe tomorrow, but that's it. 40% off. All right, I'll leave links down below in my description box if you're interested in anything, and I will see you guys next time.